Let's talk about spore traps. In the previous video you saw how a spore trap is mounted on an air pump for sampling. Well this is that same spore trap in detail. The spore trap is made up of two halves. Let's first remove the seal on the top inlet and we'll remove the seal on the bottom outlet. And the spore trap we cut open the adhesive that holds the two halves together. And there's the top and then the bottom. Mounted between the two halves is a glass slide. Here it is. And the glass slide has an adhesive applied on the top of it. What happens then is as air comes through the top of the spore trap, it is accelerated through a smaller opening in the middle and that accelerated air hits the glass slide and has nowhere to go so it travels sideways. However, particles that are captured in the air stream of the air being sampled are deposited onto the adhesive because they can't make that abrupt turn and go sideways. And generally particles in the size range between 2 and 20 microns are deposited on the adhesive slide. Then this slide is taken and in the laboratory is mounted on a microscope slide for analysis under a high magnification microscope. So overall, this is your spore trap. Top, the middle slide, and the bottom.